I'm Dr. James Wilcox from the Department of Family Medicine, and this video will go over how to evaluate for a knee effusion. You'd want to look for an effusion in the knee if your patient has a swollen knee, if it is red or hot, um, or if you have any clinical suspicion that there might be a knee effusion. You can also look for um, knee effusions if there is pain in the knee or stiffness or difficulty moving the knee. We're going to take our ultrasound probe and place it above the patella in this and evaluate the suprapatellar notch. The, the marker dot is going to be pointed towards the patient's head and we're going to have the ultrasound in a sagittal plane on the knee. For this exam, we'll want to choose the musculoskeletal or soft tissue preset. And we'll have the marker dot pointed towards the patient's head. And we will look at the knee in a sagittal view. And we want to get a small amount of the patella in view, as well as the quadriceps tendon, the femur, the quadriceps fat pad, and the prefemoral fat pad. If you're having trouble seeing an effusion, which would be this small potential space between the prefemoral fat pad and the quadriceps fat pad, you can have your patient slowly extend their knee and that will force any fluid into that potential space. And you can have them relax the knee. You could also use your other hand to squeeze the inferior part of the knee to try to express any fluid into that potential space. If you're doing a knee joint aspiration, you would find the largest fluid pocket, rotate your probe 90 degrees, and guide the needle to the suprapatellar pouch to aspirate the fluid.